this one for you guys. I thought that, uh, number one, I thought Carson Smith was really good tonight. I mean, I, he was uh, incredibly locked in from the moment he got to the ballpark um, until the last pitch was thrown. And so uh, when he's locked in, he's good. Um, and obviously he's shown that. Um, I thought that set the tone for the game for us, having him so locked in. Um, you can see the rest of the team feeding off of that also. Um, and then I thought in the first inning when we scored three runs, it made our guys feel pretty good. I mean, I, they, they knew how good their pitcher was uh, coming into the ninth game, how good he's been all year long, and so it was important for us to score early, and we did. Um, and then to come up with two great defensive plays in the seventh inning were critical for us, too. How can you tell that he was locked in? What did yours mannerisms like? Come mannerisms were really focused. Um, and really, no, just he looked focused. When, uh, when I saw him before the game, uh, our assistant coach, Jeremy Fikach, made a comment. He said, that guy's locked in like crazy. And so, I mean, I, he just different mannerisms. After being around people for a while, you start to notice when they are focused and when they're not. At what moment this year did you <clears throat> notice a big change in Carson's demeanor? It seemed like, I guess, maybe conference? Yeah, probably right. I mean, you know, he was good early anyway. I mean, the first time he grabbed the ball at U of H, he was good that first night. And UT. Uh, yeah, and so, I mean, at that part of it, he's been good. It's just that since conference, he, he's been able to settle into role. Remember, we, we couldn't. Mm -hmm get him into a consistent role. We were moving him in and out too much. And now he's been as a, as a starting guy. And, and the consistency of his work playing with Derek in between and different things has been critical for us. What do you think is about this team that just plays so well behind him? I think they have confidence that they, they know he's going out there and competing on the mound. And, and that's huge for them. And so I think they feel, they feel a sense of responsibility um, because he's out there and he's accountable at that moment. And I think it makes everybody else accountable. And it seems like no matter where you move Livingston in the lineup, bat leadoff, or you know, move down fifth, fourth, wherever he is, he's producing for you guys right now. He's, he's an amazing young man. I mean, he's been so great for us all year long. He's a great offensive player. He got really, really, truly understands the game of baseball really well. It's a lot of fun to be around.